Edward and Michelle are the current U.S. champions in American Smooth. They are also at the forefront of New York City's dance sports scene. And they take every opportunity to perform for their city, even on a hot summer night outdoors at Lincoln Center. The story of our partnership is uh, a little funny at, at times. Ed and I, I guess, had known each other for about four or five years. We used to be actually quite fierce competitors against <laughs> each other at one point in time. We had a little East Coast rivalry going between my partner and Ed's former partner, and we both split with our former partners around the same time. We just ended up seeing each other at a dance competition and uh, talking there, and we just decided we would get together and goof around. We had both individually a lot of influence from different coaches and professionals and people that said, well, why don't you call Ed? I, mean, I even had one coach actually uh, put me up against the wall and said, you gotta call her, call her. <laughs> we took our time even when we did start rehearsing together to make sure, and, uh, but it was pretty easy for me to tell right away. <laughs> My ferrets, they're my babies. <laughs> I'm an animal lover, I've always loved animals. It's my first love ever since I was a child. And uh, with our crazy schedule, I'm really unable to have dogs or you know anything that needs um, constant care. They're wonderful, playful little creatures. Um, they don't always travel with us, but sometimes I bring them to the competitions. And it's just a nice break, you know? Um, to come away from the dancing and the seriousness of what we're focusing on back to your hotel room and you just have these little bouncing fuzzy creatures that just want to entertain you and, and love you. It's just fun. Only blocks away from New York City's Central Park is the studio where Edward and Michelle practice daily. There, Edward has yet another partnership as he combines dancing with business. Dance New York has been open for about uh, two and a half years right now. Uh, we're very excited and proud to have over 50 teachers who teach out of here. They're all independent teachers. They just come and rent space. And I, I think with the 50 teachers, that's uh, the biggest group of teachers anywhere in the country, actually. Well, the teaching part of the business, I think, is really uh, exciting for me. It's um, something that I enjoy very much. It's exciting for, for me to be able to share what we do and the knowledge that we are fortunate enough to get from other people with others and see their dancing improve and sort of pass that information along. I think in teaching when you're expressing to someone what you want, to, the picture you want to see, and then you start to see it develop. Mm -hmm. it, it's just such an exciting thing to happen. And what's amazing, I find, is the more you teach, the more you start to describe it in your own body, and then you actually improve yourself. And to train in ballroom dancing, we believe that you have to really uh, hone many different skills. And we feel it can't be just, um, you know, just the, the technical side of the ballroom. It has to be the artistic side. Uh, and there's a lot of other influences in there. And I feel that all of those layers really do show uh, when you perform. The ballet lessons that we take, uh, I feel so fortunate to be able to have the coach that we do in Carol Ryu. She's, she's world renowned and works with many of the professional ballet dancers in our area. The more you study dancing and the physics of moving a body around the room, I think for us it's almost more intellectual um, at times because it really centers on just the understanding of the body components, how you need to move and, and which specific parts you need to use to get there. I'm very fortunate to have a very supportive partner. I feel one of the things we do for each other is we encourage each other separately, um, both, both per personally and professionally, as far as becoming the best and most well-rounded dancer that each of us can become on our own, um, and really pushing each other to improve on our weaknesses as well as our strengths within our own dancing. <laughs>